Hello, my name is Christian Diaz, and my topic is Westernization on non-Western religions. As we can see on the map, Western countries like Norway, the UK, Germany, France, and Spain, and the United States do not practice religion or say religion is not an important factor in their day-to-day lives. But countries like Iran, Indonesia, Pakistan, and Egypt do base their day-to-day lives on religion and think religion is very important for them. The first religion I want to talk about is the folk religion, as we can see on the map. This is practiced in the West, but it's mostly practiced in the Asia Pacific. The data set on the right shows that China, Vietnam, Taiwan, India, and Brazil are the most popular countries with folk religionists. The Belgian on the left was made in Taiwan, and similar to other religions, these are buildings where People come to practice religion, but also connect as a community, knowing that people share the same ideas. The people who they pray to differ between countries because not only do are they different countries, but they come from different backgrounds, as we can see between the two figures from China and Vietnam. Folk religion is a faith that are closely connected with certain people or ethnicity. Most of these faiths have no formal sacred texts, and most of most of these beliefs are centralized on the idea that the balance of the universe and reality can be influenced by gods or spirits, but also by human beings. The next religion I want to talk about is Islam. As we can see on the map, this is practiced mostly in Northern Africa and the Middle East, countries like Morocco and North Africa, and countries like Qatar and Saudi Arabia and the Middle East. Their buildings are known as mosques, and this is one of the most famous mosques in the world, which was built in Israel. The Kahab was built in Saudi Arabia, and is known as the most sacred and holy building for the Muslim people. Islam is a religion where people worship an unknowing God known as Allah. By following the Quran, which is a sacred text of Islam, Mother aims to live a life to complete submission to Allah. By living a life closer to God, they believe there will be a day judgment and life after death. The next religion I want to focus on is Christianity. And even though Christianity is a Western religion, there are many Eastern countries that do practice it seriously. On the map on the left, we can see that Christianity is, the most, is almost in every country and practiced. But this should not be a surprise as Christianity is the most popular religion in the world. This church on the right is a building in Romania where people come to read the Bible and connect as a community. Christianity is a religion which people base their life, morals, beliefs on the death of Jesus Christ. They believe that God created heaven, the earth, and the universe. Christians also believe Jesus is the Messiah which is known as the savior of the world, and also believe he is the son of God. One of the main issues with Westernization on non-Western religions is that people in the West deem and look down on these religions because of their practices. And this not only contradicts what Western people have to say about diversity, in this case, Western people do promote it, but they falsely promote it because they do not accept that other people have religions, like Islam, that despite their point of views, are totally different. One of the main issues is that the West tries to purport purport on other countries is that modernization is better and superior than religion. Some solutions are very simple as keeping Western ideas and cultures in the West. And for those who practice religion in the Middle East and Northern Africa, it's important to embrace it and embrace diversity. I think this could be seen in Qatar right now in the World Cup, where people knew that Qatar is a Muslim country. And despite knowing this and having prior knowledge to this, they still try to force this idea of Western culture in these countries. And this is not only wrong, but the sign of disrespect and only creates more tension 
than what people think they are trying to do, which is unite the world. Thank you. This has been Christian Diaz on the topic on westernization and non-Western religions.